Hello, greetings and good morning, guys. How is everybody? Uh, hopefully you're all in your dressing gowns, having coffee, watching the video I uploaded this morning. I thought, seeing as I was up early, I thought that I would come out and get an audit in for you. So that's what I'm doing. Um, you might have noticed already, or you might notice now when I say, but I'm filming on a different camera today. Oh, I think this one's going to be a bit wobblier, I'm afraid. Um, I do have my head cam on, but <clears throat> something's wrong with it. So a couple of times now I've charged it overnight and it, it just doesn't switch on. And that's happened today. I don't have the bloody battery pack with me because I thought I've charged it all night. I don't need the battery pack. Uh, it turns out I did. And I don't have it. So um, we're back on my camcorder today. I've only got one battery as well and it only lasts about 25 minutes. So we'll see how, uh, how we get on. Uh, anyway, today, this morning, I am at, you see it on there, look. Motorway Police Control Center. Also as well, you see this Gloucester FAHQ? I don't know what that is, but I'm wondering, and this might be a stupid thing to say, but I'm wondering if it's the firearms headquarters for the Southwest of England, or Avon in Somerset, whatever. Uh, I don't know if it is or not, but uh, we're gonna find out in a, in a short second because What's that? Collision investigation. Yeah, because we're gonna we're gonna be going in at any any point now, so we're gonna find out what it is. As always, well as always now, I've got my clipboard. I've got to say, like, be, a massive thank you for to back at the helm for putting this together for me. I was planning on doing it, and it's like fate because he turned up one day with it, so I didn't have to. Um, put it together so I'm grateful for that I'm really grateful for that anyway here we are I, I've never been in here before I mean I've drove I've driven past a lot because I used to live up that road so I've driven around oh, it's a bit dangerous I've driven past a lot but I've never actually come inside here to have a look but there are lots of police vehicles in there, look. Hopefully I don't get run over here. Yeah, lots of police vehicles in there, what we'll try and get a look at in a second. One with his lights on. But yeah, we're gonna take, oh, Gloucestershire Football Association. So it being Sunday, there's a lot of people about Sunday morning. You can imagine these guys are coming to play football. Well, they, they don't come into the football association to play rugby, are they? I'm pretty sure the rugby club is across the road. I wish I never walked across that, across that grass. Take note, police stations of the UK. If you want to stay private, put up some uh, privacy screens. I want to get like, I'm a bit anxious of um, the football stadium. I've seen some some mums coming with their kids. Do you want to have a look over there? Should I extend my pole? You're going to have to tell me what's over there. It's going to be... It's wobbly as hell up there, I bet, for you. Well, hopefully you had a little view of the inside. Ugh. Let me see if we can see around the side around here. Oh, getting knocked over. I'm really getting knocked over. Nice AstroTurf pitch over there. Yeah, um, this place isn't on Google Maps. It, does, it just doesn't come up as anything. 
And there's a hell of a lot more security around this building than there is on any other police stations that I've seen. I don't think I've seen this green mesh stuff before. So like I said before, I take note, stations of the UK, if you don't want people to look in, then you create your privacy. You create your privacy. Oh. Can't see. Well, I can see through. Can you see through? You can't. You'll have to let me know what's going on in there. Well, I say you'll have to let me know. I just I'm going to watch the video before you. <laughs> right. So yeah, I do apologise about the shakiness, which is inevitably going to be on this one. But uh, yeah, I don't have a stabiliser yet. But I've been looking for one. It's called a gimbal, right, I think. But the thing is, where I use my camera rather than my phone, I can't really find a good gimbal that fits a camera. So I think I'm just going to have to get a good phone as well. So if any of you guys know a phone with a really good camera, something that I could uh, use for my auditing, then let me know and I will um, I'll look into it. But... Uh, people are telling me to get an iPhone, but I, I can't, I'm an Android user, man. I I don't really understand how to use <laughs> an iPhone. So, uh, I don't know. I, I guess I could just learn. But uh, iPhone's the best cameras. I thought Samsung's had the best cameras. There's a lot more civilians around here than I thought. Oh, look. You see through the gate. Why have they got the spinny razor wire stuff there? Or is that just for decoration? Why there and not all the way around? <laughs> Stop the spread. There was a police car in here on my way up with, a, with his headlights on and now he's not here so I don't know if um, the headlights are just switched off and he's got out or if uh, he's left I don't know not that that matters at all I guess but I was just curious I'm going to take a look around the side here, see if they've got this green stuff all the way around. It looks like it, though. It looks like it. Again, some more of that kind of weird razor wire type stuff. Which is kind of strange. Yeah, they got this green stuff all the way around. So they're clued up enough to know that they need to create their own privacy if they desire it. It's a shame really, because they got a few of those black police cars in there, the AMPR ones, which I wouldn't have mind of getting a, a closer view of. So, a little curb here, we could stand up to have a look over. 
Oh. Oh. Nearly fell over. Couple of police cars. Somebody doing something in a police car, clearing it out or some something like that. See if we can see over here. No, can't see over that bit. Big old communications tower that. And there we are at the end back to the car park where the football is going on. Man, this battery, man, is already less than halfway. <laughs> That's not good, is it? 11 minutes from full to less than half. That is not great. Sometimes they go on a little bit longer, but in fact, I'm gonna cut the camera for a minute. And uh, no, I'm not actually. I'm not. And I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit anxious of, uh, not anxious, but I'm aware that um, my last few videos have been in excess of 30 minutes. Now, I mean, I don't know how you guys feel about that. I know I talk some rubbish when I'm walking around. I know you don't get to see much. And if you're here just for an interaction, then... Um, you could end up being disappointed because obviously sometimes I don't get a reaction to the very end and uh, I often diffuse it or try to now rather than kind of perpetuate it strictly like just for content because that's, that's what it would be it wouldn't it wouldn't be an honest me if I was just kind of making things worse because um, because I was trying to generate some content, so I don't do that anymore. I'm not going to do that anymore. So, um, but let me know what you think of the uh, of the videos. Are the gates opening now? So we could have a little look. Um, yeah, let me know what you think about the the video length, etc. Yeah, we uh, get a good shot inside now of those police cars. Little AMPR, let's have a little zoom in, make sure we don't get knocked over. Um, yeah, like I said, let me know because I would be keen to um, to know the answer to that. That so guy's supposed to wait for the gates to close. Oh, he did. <laughs> There's another car coming up now. Ah, oh, it's a police car, look. Undercover car coming out. I don't want them to try and say I am um, blocking the road. But you see them coming out. He's reversing there, look. and a police car also, uh, and a marked car, which is what we wanted. Ooh. You know what, considering how warm it was yesterday, right? It's cold today. I'm cold. I'm hoping it's gonna brighten up a bit. Let me go that side where I can actually see the cars. I'm hoping it's gonna brighten up a bit and get a bit warmer. But, uh, I've gone from, like, being really hot yesterday to the opposite today like my hands are cold we've got two march units coming out now let's stand back see if we can get them both in the shot at the same time are they coming out oh they're not coming out oh one of them is the other one looks like it's parked up I wonder if they're going to put their blues on. 
Let's get some blues, mate. Can we? Or no? I don't think we are. No. Silence. I like that. Oh. <laughs> what is it with me almost falling over every time I do an audit? I always trip on something. I nearly tripped over yesterday when I stepped on a stone at Gloucester. I don't know if these guys are coming out. No, they just look like they're just parking up. We've got the guys in the um, in the uh, in the BM oh in the BMW over there with the light just switch their lights off and back on. I don't know what they're up to, but. I don't know if you can see it, you can't see them through that way. Yeah, I don't know what they're up to. Whether they're going in or out is, um, is unknown to me. I'm intrigued by this police car though, which was on the way out, and then it decided it wasn't. But these guys seem to be all right with me. I mean, nobody said anything to me yet. We had, you saw obviously the one guy go in and the other guy come out. Nothing was said. This guy looked at me, walked away. He's good. What is it with my camera blue stopping and then starting? I don't really understand why this camera does it. Oh, he's talking to somebody about, do you know what he looks like there? I'll be honest with you. He looks like that Detective Inspector Michael Ray who um, violated me. I don't think it is him. Let me have a zoom in and see. Can't really see on my on my bad camera. But I'm going to give it five more minutes and um, I might take another little walk around. But I would really like to see a car on blues come out. But this being uh, um, traffic, what was it again? Traffic officers mainly, or road officers. I'm, I'm wondering, they're probably only going to go out on the blues and twos if they're going to go to a, um, a road, a, an accident, obviously. Oh, they closed quicker. Why did they close so much quicker that time? I don't know why they closed so quick that time, but when the guy went in, it was, uh, I actually struggled to get out from there. It was, uh, it took a lot longer to close than it did previously. But these guys quite clearly got the memo. They are leaving me alone. They had a little talk about me. And then they're going in, which is nice to see. So I love it when I can say a pass. And I feel like that's a couple of passes in a row. Which is cool. I like that. So maybe not all of Avon in Somerset are as, uh, as bad as they seem. But yeah, I'm going to call it a day at that, so thanks for watching. Um, these guys got a pass. <laughs>